Hey, I'm uh, back. Uh, thank you for uh, that pause. I appreciate it. Um, I'm being asked if the external drive is the reason for the frame rate drops. It might be. It might be unoptimized code. It might be the day one patch causing that. It might be my Xbox. Um, it might be the stream. So I don't know um, exactly what's causing them. Um, they don't really bother me that much, to be perfectly honest. And so I really can't... I, I just don't want to comment right now. I was thinking about it while I was taking the quick break, and I was thinking that the data isn't being pulled directly from the drive. The data is basically, if, if the Xbox One is designed properly, the data is being pulled from the drive using the USB connection, but then it's sitting in the system RAM, and there's 8 gigs of RAM in there. So I was thinking that the data could simply be loaded into RAM every time, the um, and it's fast RAM. It's not the world's fastest RAM, but it's fast RAM. And so I was thinking, maybe it's the USB, maybe it's just the game. I don't know exactly. So, I, again, it'll probably get... There are things I could probably do, but I don't really want to deal with them right now. Okay, moving on. HQ, securing the Will, server room. Over. more of them. Hide. They're coming. Paul about this, about the calculations. I tried to make you listen to me. By shoving a gun in my face? Yes, a gun. The universal symbol for shut the fuck up and listen to me. Sound logic is out of You... Hold up. I can't move the, uh, make any sense. camera. Why are you even here? Yes. Is your biggest concern right now? Backups on route to flush your mouth. Paul brought me here to clean up your mess. My mess? Do you even Target spotted exiting service elevator. That's not them. You have no context for any of this. This is really good digital here. performance. Let me Live tell you something. Issues. Props to these actors. They would have had to put on camera suits Speaking with with sensors and. Make it personal. They're trying to kill us, Will. It's pretty goddamn personal. I mean, that's some acting. Those guys are acting. Listen. Getting you involved is the last thing I wanted. I, I'm sorry. Right. Get out of here. Oh. This way. Hold on, I'm gonna check this hard drive. Okay. Done here. Don't see anything else on these servers. I like these servers, they look cool. Sounds like there's pandemonium going on outside. Yeah, here. Look at this. It's the goddamn paramilitary out there. It's another target. What's their chopper waiting for? Is that guy? I saw that guy earlier. Like he's part of this. Maybe even leading it. I don't know if I'm going to stream Act 2. Like I said, uh, I, my usual policy for streams are is that I don't like to um, I don't like to spoil people's games. I mean, with Alan Wake's American Nightmare, I was made I made an exception, but um, I I just don't like I don't like basically I want people to buy these games and I want people to buy Quantum Break. I want there to be another Quantum Break game. I want there to be another Alan Wake game. So. 
I don't know if I'm going to stream Act 2, to be perfectly honest. Okay. Oh, that's the zoom in button. It's the trigger. You're the one with the door busting skills. Okay, I'll go bust this door. Will, get out! Oh, God. Target's armed. Opening fire. He's pinned down. Yeah, I know this. Okay, I have seen people stream this game early, and not a single person I saw, short of Remedy employees, could actually aim and shoot. This, ga uh, this game is so freaking easy to aim and shoot properly, I don't know what these streamers were doing. I mean, look at this. See, look, I'm, I'm aiming. I'm aiming before I shoot. What was their excuse? I could see these guys aim, and not a single freaking one of them could aim in front of them. It's not hard. That was so easy. Will, are you okay? I have no idea why there were a lot of preview yeah. streamers that had that had problems figuring that out. This is way out of hand. I'd used a gun before. I'd been in a couple tough spots. Never had an army of pro gunmen chase me. I was positive that the experiment would work. But the figures were correct. Because the specialists were a bunch of goddamn idiots. Their formulas were missing these variables entirely. Oh boy. You're seriously making corrections right now? Well, if they made them in the first place, we wouldn't be here. Oh Let's boy. Get out of here. We just affected something in the story. I don't know what exactly, but we just affected something in the in the live action episode. Okay. Just gonna check to see if there's anything else I can affect here before we move on. Oh, they were... T I'm being asked how bad those streamers were. It was it was painful to watch these people play Quantum Break. Painful. They were... They were dying. They were dying left and right. They had no concept of aiming and shooting whatsoever. Every time they'd aim, the guy would be on the other side, pointed in the opposite direction. I, I mean, seriously, these people play video games? You, these people are actually, you know, people actually like watching people who don't know what they're doing play? I'm sorry, I'm venting right now. But, but really, legitimately, one would have assumed that, you know, either Microsoft or Remedy or, or whoever it was that gave those preview codes out for streaming purposes would have gotten competent people to stream the game. As such, you know, I, I know I, I heard Remedy say this. Now, Remedy was competent. Remedy was like the only people when they when they did preview streams of this a couple of days ago. The Remedy employees knew how to play, and they mentioned some. I think maybe even I brought it up, but they mentioned specifically that it's kind of a double-edged sword when you choose who can play and who can't. If a person streams and plays the game badly because they have no concept of how a controller works or how an analog stick works. Um, it makes the game look too hard. But if you put somebody that knows what they're doing, like a Remedy employee behind the controller, and they play competently, some people might assume the game is too easy. So it's like a damned if you do, damned if you don't kind of thing. Personally, if you don't know how a controller works, don't stream games. There's nothing more frustrating than seeing a person die over and over and over again. There's the elevator. And there's the end of my vent. Look at how easy this is. I'm not saying the game is easy. I'm saying I know how to play it. <laughs> Again, I'm playing on normal difficulty, which is actually supposedly very tough. But I'm having no problems with the controls whatsoever. Is this something that we... Oh. Time's acting up again. Nothing's no happening. We have to go. Team, have Jack and William Joyce been detained? Did you hear that? They know our names. They knew we'd be here. They must be after the machine. The elevator. It's the only way out. Yeah, I want to take a look at all these computers first. Thank you very much. The big maniac wants to, uh... 
see if there's anything left on any of these keyboards or... In here. No, nothing here. There's two more. They, they said, according to the game, they said there's two more stuff to say nothing of extra stutters and stuff. There could be extra stutter com uh, components that I might be missing. Yes, bad stream. I'm being told bad streamers can make a game look unplayable. I agree. Come on. They're not entertaining to watch. Oh, found it. Found something. A library protest from Liam Burke, from Charlie Wincott. Oh, it's a tablet. I thought it was a book for a second. All right, let's see if these doors work just to be on the stage. I don't think they do, but okay. This part of the building looks absolutely beautiful. I love these arches. I just love it. It looks like the inside of a church or something. That's really cool looking with that architecture. The 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 con. Look at this. Look at this. The contrast between the two architectures is just so cool to look at. All right. You can't go to your car. Monarch could be expecting that. We have to, Jack. It's important to fix the fracture. I, I need, we need to get to my car. Okay, just, just walk me through this, Will. Okay, time's broken, fine. But now you're saying we could fix it? In theory, I built something for such an event years ago. But finding the countermeasure won't be easy. The countermeasure? What? Time stoddard. Okay. What happened? Maybe the door's still open. Let me try. I may have stuttered. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Will? Oh, crap. Frozen again. Okay, let's try this. Somehow I could focus and unfreeze Will. Even if the world was still frozen. Stutter. She was right. About the fracture. About all of this. Let's take this. Let's take this. Mine. Okay, I can't go I can't go around this. Oh, that's the door. Okay. You don't want to be here when the stutter collapses. Yes, I do. Hey, is there any other emails? Or, oh, here we go. Like somebody left there. Okay. Found the last narrative object. That's cool. Okay. All right, check this out. Can I affect these guys? Yes, I can. <laughs> nice. Alright, I'll finish screwing around. I just think it's funny to take guns away from soldiers <laughs> who want to hurt people. Yeah, if you saw those streams, you wouldn't want to you wouldn't want to play those games. Why would you? Where's your car? This, this way. way. Ammo. Wow, that's cool. Oh, that's cool looking. I'm taking everybody's weapon. I met this girl. What are you doing? On my way here. I'm gonna get her moving. See if we can save her. She's not in freezing. It worked on you. Why isn't it working on the others? I don't know. It may have to do with chronon exposure. Look at them all. It's a goddamn invasion. What are they doing? Why? They're taking everybody, every witness to what they've done. Wow, that's cool. Oh, they, they stole the TV! 
Delta House! <laughs> what is the... Now, from now on, Delta is on double secret probation. I'm going to tell you that. <laughs> See if I can take his weapon. Okay, I can. So hopefully some of those guys will survive. They have no weapons. Alright. Oh, the stutter. Oh, I see. I'm oh that's cool. Alright, 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 already. Sorry, I like screwing around over here. Seems to be like a like a trip or something around me. Let me tell you something. From now on, yeah, the, stream, the streamers have been allowed to play Act One and Act Two. I have seen streams of Act Two. I've also I've not really seen too many streams of Act One. I intentionally avoided watching them, but uh, there were previews that showed uh, sections of gameplay starting here. Yeah, this scene was probably the first where most of the previews were. This right here, of course, is an Alan Wake reference. There are a lot of Alan Wake references in this, uh... For now. There are a lot of Alan Wake references in this scene, no, but... No. Or this car. game. The patrol in the parking lot. Oh, God, that's... It's... Okay. Okay, Will. Calm down, okay? I'll take care of this. I'll, I'll fight my way through. I'll get the car and I'll bring it around. Are you sure you can handle this? No. Are you sure you can fix time? No. Then we'll call it even. Okay. I kind of just want to screw around in here. I've never seen lecture halls this ornate before. Um, I'm sure Yale has them. But, uh, yeah, this is a pretty ornate lecture hall for that kind of... Oh, cool. I, can, I, can, I think I can manipulate this now. Let's see. Alan Wake. Love this guy's stuff. Yeah, me too. And there's another Alan Wake reference. There's another Alan Wake reference. At least one more Alan Wake reference in um, Act uh, 2. Wait, hold on. That looks like an that looks like an atomic bomb. I don't recognize those formulas. F of x looks like calculus or some y of y of x. Anybody know those formulas? I haven't I haven't had to take basic mathematics in like you know my I I mean I took my senior year of of, col of high school I took I took calculus AP calculus and that was it. That was the last time I ever had to take a math course. Jack. Be careful. Yeah. Okay. I, I will. What the hell? My powers were growing. I started to sense things. Premonitions. Echoes from the past. Just got orders from Monarch Actual. They want us to find a car belonging to William Joyce while we're here. You got a plate number? It's coming. It's probably Boron or Neutron or some shit. We got contact! See, look at that. That was not hard. I mean, I don't have my time powers yet, but even I know. Not hard. All right, where's your car, Will? I have not played Alan Wake on the Xbox One just yet. I can oh. see an echo of the past. 
Will, arriving at the university. Okay. I want the assault rifle back. Okay, we're good. So yeah, I've still got a pistol. And I still got this. I want to keep this for right now. Alright, let's go check a look at this guy. I hope to God I'm not too late. But that's I'm seeing the past. I hope to God I'm not too late. There we go. Okay, let's check out the car. Oh shit! Something clicked. I could reach out and stop time in a focused area. My powers are manifesting. My Jedi powers are increasing. Again, not hard. Let's see, where's that last guy? Over here. I might have gotten him, actually. Guy out of, oh, here they are. There's three guys over here. Where's the other guy? I saw him. There you are. I like it. Change of plans. Screw the car. I need to get to Will. He's in trouble. I mean, I, I like this game. I really do. The gameplay's good. Story's great. Performance not, might be my hard drive, but, you know. I can't reload. The game won't let me reload right now. Could try screwing around a little bit in here, but yeah, ammo's full. I don't think there's anything else, but it didn't tell me about story components or anything along those lines. I don't know if that'll affect anything here. It's a cool looking little field area. But... I don't think any of this will actually affect gameplay any. Or the episodes. All right, let's move on. <laughs> Beth? Oh, you're Jack Joyce. Where is he? Where's my brother? They're taking him to the library. You might still be able to catch them. Why are you helping me? You're with them. It's more complicated than... Look, I don't know if you can make it, but you should hurry. That's the first time you saw Beth Wilder. Yeah, but definitely not the first time she saw me. Will. Will!
Okay, moving on. No time to lose. I gotta get to Will. Here. It's supposed to take William, William Joyce, Joyce alive, alive if he doesn't put, he doesn't up, a put fight. up a fight. Please, please, let me go. Let me go. I can I shut can the hell up. Hell up. But just shut just the fuck up, up alright? Right. All right, let's take a look. Hi. <laughs> and Max Payne we have. <laughs> shit, shit. Oh shit. That shouldn't be No, 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 no. Shit. Again, no problems with gameplay. None. What the fuck is going on in there? We're moving in. Go, go, go. Reminds me a lot of Al of of Max Payne. Actually, it plays like Max Payne. Granted, there's a little bit of cover mechanic, but it plays like Max Payne. This is like bullet time cranked to a billion. I love it. I mean, I remember somebody when they first started seeing the previews for this game, they 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 described it as like, you know, is this the return of Bullet Time that we really didn't see in Alan Wake, and except for like one cutscene or something. And uh, I said, this is more than Bullet Time. It looks like after seeing the previews, this is like Bullet Time to a million. And I was right. Okay. Okay, I can't interact with anything in here. I'm trying to, but I, I don't see anything I can interact with. Okay, I'm being told to check the time vision. Okay, there's definitely something here. Don't make sense. sense. Dragging this asshole to the library? Airlift's already initiated. He should be gone by now. The time machine. You taking the time machine? Hey, hey. I said don't talk. talk. Okay, I see a ghost here, but no way to affect it. Is there anything down there? Let's see, hold on. Yeah, nothing down here, I don't see. This might be from the uh, previous act. Alright, let's move on. There we go. Yeah, Max Payne Puri probably would have been better if Remedy worked on it. I think it could have been a lot worse, though. I gotta give him that. You still had no idea that Wilder was helping you? She wasn't the only one. Is that another stutter? They cut the power. Lights out may come in handy. Somebody cut the power. Awesome. Who am I? I'm Jack Joyce, man. Hold on while I reload a little bit.
Again, this is, it's not hard to aim and shoot. Eh, I don't like this weapon very much. I can't take this. They're not using assault rifles anymore. They're using these weapons, and they're not very good. Kind of inaccurate, but I'll take it. Okay. And still no balls vending machines. You heard me, Remedy. We need... Balls vending machines. Okay, about the graphic novel cutscenes, I talked to some of the guys at Remedy years and years and years ago when they first announced Alan Wake. I asked them if they could implement the graphic novel cutscenes in Alan Wake, and they said, unfortunately, from a stylistic standpoint, not from a legal standpoint, from a stylistic standpoint, the graphic novel cutscenes were too much of a Max Payne staple to be compatible with other, you know, things. burst mode right now. Where is everybody? Gotcha. That's beautiful. That is just beautiful. Heavy pistol, okay. Okay, gotta get to the library. Like that. Not really seeing any plot points or anything. Nothing too crazy here. Maybe? No time to lose. I gotta get to Will. Let's see. Alright, that's the exit. Uh, maybe like a, maybe some Dalid jelly or something in here? Uh, all the cafeterias are empty. Oh, come on, they really wouldn't... Oh, yeah, right, it is four in the morning. I was thinking, like, they wouldn't have something open, but yeah, no. I have to reach Will before it's too late. Yeah, I'm seeing frame rate drops on the feed for you guys. That's not happening on my end. I think it's just the connection. Why are you taking me here? It's a library. I need to return some fucking Like, books. this is smooth right now. Got William Joyce in the library. <laughs> Will. They took me to the library. I gotta find a way in. I gotta get to him fast. Where did that come from? Oh, nothing crazy on the bathroom. Yeah, I think I know where I'm going here. I've seen some of these components. I gotta get into here, but I think it's locked. Starting to wake up a little bit. Yeah, I can't go in here, at least not right now. There's gotta be another way. Yeah, I think it's locked. I need to get in that library. I can't get in through here, I don't think. Oh. Can I jump? Yeah, I guess so. Gonna have to jump up. Yep. I don't remember this from the previews, but okay. That's 
That's the game you want me to play. I'll play that game. It's like I'm not the only one with a grudge. I miss these Night Owl radio shows. Enjoy. I don't know exactly what's going on, but I've just heard about security personnel in the employee of Monarch Solutions detaining students. And some reports of gunfire. Now, I don't want to jump the gun here. This is unconfirmed, and obviously I don't know the details, but no matter how you slice it, it sounds like a bad scene. You know I'm not a big fan of Monarch or how they do things, but at the same time, I hope nobody's going overboard with this protest thing. It's just a goddamn building, people. It ain't worth anybody getting shot over. Although, if they are shooting people over, that's some heinous bullshit right there. Either way, I got a feeling this is gonna get a whole lot worse before it gets better. Stay safe, people. Cool. No, David, I'm just making it look easy. In comparison to some of the other streamers I saw, this game looked near impossible. Now, I am not playing this on easy. I'm actually playing this on normal difficulty right now. So be aware that there is a harder difficulty. Let me see if I can get up there. Oh, I see what I can do. I have an idea. Uh, a little bit, again, another little bit of Half-Life 2 kind of thing. You have physics problem solving here, but in this case, it's time problem solving. Observe. I have to slow this thing down. Oh, wrong switch. There we go. And I can walk into the stutter very well. Nailed it. Maniac has just earned his degree. Time. I like it. I like it a lot. And now I can try to see if I can climb this ladder. I think they were playing on normal as well. I th uh, I'm being asked what difficulty the streamers were playing on. Usually they were playing on normal. By default, the difficulty in this game is normal. This is Airlift Prime. We've got the time machine core in transit. Hey! Hands where I can see! Somebody's helping me. What the hell is going on around here? Oh boy. HQ, we've got William Joyce in the library. Waiting orders. Takes a second sometimes. That's fine with me. Anybody else in here? I don't see anybody. Oh, that's uh, ammo. Okay. I said he's in the library, so I gotta go for the library. Gotta find the exit, gotta find the exit. Library. I need to return some fucking books. HQ, we've got William Joyce in the library. Awaiting orders. Over. All right, moving on. A couple of components over there. And that's not ammo. All right, fair enough. You would love to see people play the game on easy. Well, right now I'm not having problems playing it on normal. Granted, like I said, I'm used to playing games like Max Payne and stuff. 
And we got the return of bullet time. Time shield. That's a new one. Strong in the force I am. Watch this. guy is not difficult. I I don't see where the streamers were having problems. Will. You all right? You're fine. All right. You're fine. Okay, there's stuff up there definitely. I got a whole new batch of messed up shit I need you to explain. Those are charges. Those are explosive charges, and I was just setting off propane tanks next to them. That's great. All right, let's go check this out. Gotta go up here. There's definitely ammo up here. Oh, there's William. We have to hurry. Where's my car? I didn't like the color. Let's get a new one. What? No, Jack. I need them. Uh. Hold that thought. My briefcase was in that car. Shotgunner advancing on hostile. Got one. Got him. Shotgunner. Got him. Shotgun's perfect after a time leap like that. All right. Yeah, I think so. Again, not difficult. I was getting a little fancy over there, but I've seen some streamers take five, four, five, four, five, or six times to get through that sequence. Oh, sweet! I get to keep the shotgun. Okay. We have to get to my briefcase. Then we find Beth Wilder. Why? Who is she? She knows about the fracture. I trust her. Glad you trusted somebody. It's not that simple, Jack. They kept secrets from you to keep you safe. Safe? Look around you, Will. Does this feel safe to you? This isn't my fault. Beth warned me this would happen. I did everything in my power to stop it. But you never told me any of this. I couldn't just... How long have you known? We don't have time for this now, Jack. We have to get to that briefcase. Okay, briefcase. Briefcase. We're looking for a briefcase. All right. Briefcase.
Let's move before more of them show up. All right, let's take a look. Jack. Um. Huh? Jack, we gotta go. Hold on. I'm sorry, Jack. No! What are you doing? Only what's necessary. Think about this. You don't know what's at stake. I know exactly what's at stake. That's why I'm here. You believe you can stop what's coming? I'm giving you one chance to change your mind. This path, it's already said it can't be changed. The past, the future, uh, uh, I've seen it. I've lived it for 17 years. 17 years. It was you, the first experiment. Come with me and we can see this through. Or hold on to your hope and burn with it. Now listen, I built a device. I can stop this. I can. You can't. This is madness. There's no harm in trying. There is. That's why I can't risk you opposing me, Will. It doesn't have to end like this. We can't just let this happen. I'll never stop trying. It took me years to come to terms with what must be done. But we don't have years. Wait. Trigger. I never wanted this. I'm being told the act is long. Well, it's over. Um, I'm not I think I should be hearing music here, but I have the music disabled. So, I'm just going to hit continue. Okay, this is the first junction. I now have control of him. My name is Paul Serene. I founded Monarch Solutions 17 years ago with a very clear purpose. There are those who would question my actions. I'm recording this as a final statement of vindication, a testimony of how things came to be. I've always been devoted to my mission, never deterred from my goal, no matter the sacrifice, because I've seen where this leads. I've seen where it all ends. We have a problem. No word from Jack Joyce's transport. It should have arrived here by now. We may have a traitor on the inside. You're due for your treatment. I'll find who's behind this. Find Jack. That's our priority. Get your best man on it. There's more. As you know, Jack's level of interference led to unexpected complications. Witnesses from the university were transported here. You need to take a look. We can't afford any further obstacles at this stage of the plan. Now, I see two options. We could use force, remove any loose ends. But if those witnesses disappear, the public will start asking questions, potentially turn on Monarch. Sir?
Alternatively, I could mount a broad PR strategy, get the city on our side. All clear, sir. But that leaves us with the... The loose ends. Precisely. The choice is yours, but keep Mr. in mind... Serene? The men will view your decision as a unified strategy moving forward. Sorry about that. Um, you're right, you can't hear me because I had my mic muted for some reason. I'm very sorry about that. Did you guys see that stuttering I just saw too? I suggest we deal with the issue at hand. Liam Burke over there can explain the situation in more detail. Of course. Sir, who is this? Amy Ferrero. You didn't see stuttering? One of the witnesses. During the cutscene? Awaiting your orders on how to proceed. We had Jack in custody, but I was starting to witness visions from the future which made it clear that could change. That's weird. Soon. It was the first time I'd visited the Ground Zero operation in ages. The location I'd arrived in when I went 17 years back in time. The location where my fate was sealed six years ago. Jack would never understand the necessity of what I'd done. It wasn't the death William deserved. But his knowledge posed too great a risk to our plan. How long until the core is ready for transport? It'll be in route to Monarch headquarters in less than an hour. Installation should be complete before the gala. Good. Yeah, I saw some really bad stuttering during that cutscene. Uh, just awful, awful stuttering. And um, that could very well have been because of background loading or something. I'm surprised you guys didn't see it, but maybe it has to do with the fact that because I'm streaming. Yeah, the screen was very badly distorted. See, can I mess with these cars? I guess not. Um, for those of you Alan Wake fans, actually, um, I I didn't know if you guys knew this, but actually, this kind of option was supposed to be something that would have was originally supposed to happen in Alan Wake. Alan Wake was supposed to be able to put you in the shoes of Agent Nightingale originally, and you were going to play out things like in Agent Nightingale's story. Here's the ram. I want this delivered to my office. What is it? A reminder. And there's a stutter. Okay, I'm going to make a decision here. And this decision is going to impact the rest of the epi the, the rest of the episode. Now, I know what decision they make in the book. The book is very clear about what decision they choose to make. But I kind of want to hear what you guys think. So... Let's call it up, shall we? My powers grew stronger, even as the Cronon Syndrome worsened. I could choose a path that would become the actual future. But it wasn't optional. The moment wouldn't end until I made up my mind. Any potential threats to our plan need to be erased. Wait! Monarch would take a hardline approach. Crush all obstacles, eliminate all witnesses. It would be harsh. But I had made hard choices for the greater good before. I dug through the area and I found everything I could on your bro. This is messed up, man. I 
trusted Monarch, but the people of Riverport would turn against us. You Our secrets would be safe, but the public would hate us, and Jack would gain new allies. Monarch's got no authority to stop you, and you tell that to everybody on that bridge. Initialize a PR campaign. I want to steal. And that violence was because of Jack Joyce. Monarch would take a PR-friendly approach and manipulate the public into siding with us. Our lies would give us control. The manhunt continues as authorities search for Jack Joyce. Hey, somebody's sneaking around down there. Hey! I think that's Jack Joyce! We'd use the media to expose and hunt for Jack. I uploaded all the files I stole on that USB stick from the Monarch security station. But the eyewitnesses would be out there, and Jack would learn our secrets. And as I said all that, uh, my audio went out again. So we're going to repeat what I just said. Basically, I have two options right in front of me. The hardline option and the PR option. Now, I know which options do what in this game. But only as far as Act 2. I don't know what happens in Act 3 or later Acts. Nor do I know how this affects the in-game uh, television series. However, however... Um, if I choose, I know which option is chosen in the book, and I know which option is not, which option does what in certain segments for Act 2. However, if I pick the hardline option, I know that it will kill Amy. And I really don't want to kill her, because I like her as a character. So, those are my two options, the hardline option or the PR option. They mentioned a bridge, and they mentioned a protest on the bridge if I pick the hard line. I also know that I'll be, you know, you'll be playing with, you know, with the character of Nick in Act 2 if I choose the hard line option, but Amy dies. In the PR option, I don't know if that bridge protest is going to happen, but I do know that uh, Amy will survive. So which is it going to be? I can't decide. I think I, I'm kind of leaning towards the PR option. We can't risk any unwanted attention. Convince the I've just been tell. given the soft Keep choice achievement. Send them home. Initialize a PR campaign. We need the city on our side. Not this one. She's the head of the anti-monarch movement. I think we're looking at the new face of our campaign. Jack! There's no other way out. I'm going through the machine. Oh, wait. No! Jack! This way! Jack! I didn't know we could see this. This is new. I use my power to guide us. To decide how to best prepare for the inevitable end of time. That gives the chosen few a chance to survive. I've seen the end of time. Seventy percent of the community agree with my choice. <laughs> 